quietly by and allow people in, in, in our midst. It's not enough to say, but are all the Arabs this, this way? The Arab who murdered those 16 Jews, the day before he murdered them, was innocent. So, so therefore we, we let him, him stay. We don't know which, which Arab who until today has done nothing will tomorrow do something and murder Jews. We don't know. What we do know is that there is not one Arab in all of Israel who wants to live in a Jewish state, just as there is not one Jew in this room who wants to live in Jerry Fowler's Christian state. <laughs> what contempt we have for Arabs. What contempt. Liberals. We have to raise their living standards and then they'll be good Arabs. Electricity. Give them electricity and they'll be good Arabs. Give them indoor toilets, then they'll sit quietly. No alechem levado yichiadam. That's what the Bible says. Not by bread alone shall they live. Not by bread alone. They have a national pride. You want to buy them? Buy their pride with an indoor toilet? by telling them you live better than the Arabs of Iraq, they know that they live better than the Arabs of, of Iraq. But they also know that the Arabs of Iraq live in their own country, an Arab state, and the, Jew, and the, and the Arabs of Israel live in the Jewish state. And that's the difference. Jews who don't have national pride can never understand Arabs who do. Tragedy. Tragedy. We sit and we hear nonsense.